Welcome to Juliet's tea leaf reading and coming back to the amazing revelations of a new crown for England and as I was saying before that there is a crown, a new crown to be presented and looking deeper into this teacup I can see that there's going to be two members of the royal family who are going to be a constant headache for the royalty and you know it's like well one of them is like calling out well what about me what about me it's like well they want to be like special Welcome to Juliet's Tea Leaf Reading and this is an extension of a reading of the cup where we have revealed the new crown for England and as you can see all these specs here are all the news that are coming from around the world look at that and all the well wishes all the good blessings it's really like really nice environment nice energy coming through and it's wonderful welcome to Juliet's tea leaf reading and we're continuing the reading for the new crown for England and I can say to you also that in relation to this crown there are three locations three very important locations that I see here in relation to this new crown so I can see also it's like a very big chapel and if you see the crown here, I'm sensing this chapel with a high, high, like a high roof ceiling. And it's just amazing what I'm seeing here. It's just amazing. Welcome back to Juliet's Tea Leaf Reading. And we're carrying on with the reading for revelations of a new crown for England and I'm looking really closely here about the whole story being unfolded and you know it's like I'm getting here signals left right and center and there's a letter here that is popping out and that letter is H and H as we know is for Harry and what can that mean because that H is being like floating around on someone's mind I see a H and that letter is a symbol right there where I'm pointing right there and really it's like what does that mean? Welcome back to Juliet's Tea Leaf Reading and back to the reading of a new crown for England as it is revealed in my teacup. So you can see above here that it's really like a crown here and I'm getting like the person who's going to be crowned is I'm getting here that the person who's going to be crowned is in need of guidance by the royal team um, not enough experience so I'm sensing like the person is may not be older 
so things to be learnt and it's okay I'm also sensing a bishop I'm sensing this bishop and I can say that it's related to a cathedral but he's not showing me his face and it's this bishop that is in the middle of this whole scenario. Welcome back to Juliet's tea leaf reading and looking a bit closer now to my teacup. You can see here the two really large spots that I'm finding here and also it's like well these are the issues that have been really hampering the royalty and I wanted to draw your attention to that welcome back to Juliet's tea leaf reading and this is really an extension of this teacup reading because of the many symbols that I'm finding in this cup and I think it's important that I reveal them to you so what I'm also seeing between these two negative people who are constantly attacking the royal family is that there is a spaceship or a drone or some kind of flying object along with other flying ob objects that are influencing these two it's like they have travel they need to go overseas or travel constantly to and fro and I'm getting that with them now with the second person that I was been talking about that second person has with them always a bodyguard or a team of bodyguards it's like he's guarded and always on guard well that's a good thing considering his bad mouthing and throwing out negative energy around the world Welcome back to Juliet's Tea Leaf Reading and you know I'm carrying on with the new royal crown now getting back to these two people who are constant like bother for the new head one of them I can tell you is really hurtful hurting with words pointing with sharp claws and you can see here really sharp sharp symbol here and you know this is no joke so I'm also getting from the same person very judgmental and always judging whatever springs in the person's mind it's like a one-sided thing biased and it's like constantly a one-sided attack against the royal and royalty welcome back to Juliet's tea leaf reading and this is a continuing reading session regarding the revelations of a new crown of England and I'm going deeper into the symbolism here and I'm also getting now the second person who is a constant bother to the royal family I can tell you the personality traits of this person constantly bad mouthing it's like a bad mouthing affair with this person sour soul like the inside of this person is so like like lemon not lime like a lemon and it's really like really 
resentful. It's like this person hasn't dealt with their heart. And if I could give that person some advice, I would say that you need to cleanse your spiritual heart. It's full of darkness and negativity which has been implanted by themselves or by others and this has to stop.